Hi friends, welcome to my channel. What are we today? What are we doing today? Today, Mermaid is over, or at least we are in the last weeks of Mermaid. It was a beautiful ride. What you see me have here is actually my 2024 Mermaid Challenge, and as you notice, I did five mermaids five including the tester here for the derwent artist pencils that i was graciously um had an opportunity to use in a previous scroller box and we have already talked about this but this was the first one here and yeah this was actually a wonderful experience and I went ahead and drew something for the unicorn. I drew my unicorn, but I'm not sure if I want to use this. So, sorry about that. Um, yeah, I was talking about unicorn and the unicorn that I drew, but I'm not sure if I'm gonna use it. We'll see when June comes around what we're gonna do. But today we are talking about these four mermaids that I did for Mermaid. I did Happy, Dark, Magic, and Starry. And we're going to be looking at these now in a bit more detail in this video. Okay, so first let's start with Happy um, Intentions. I was just thinking about a happy little mermaid, happy to see her little friend. These mermaids were colored with the Crayola color pencils um yeah guys honestly i was enjoying using my crayola color pencils here they are yeah this is the blue i have them i have a set of a hundred i have the i don't have the full set um the full set comes in a hundred and fifty pencils and I was graciously gifted 120 pack that was added on to the 50 pack that I gave, that I had already that I told you guys about. And what I did was I took out the double colors and re-gifted them to a family member. And so I have now like 153 because I do have the Color of the World series. I do have the 120 set that was graciously gifted to me and well I took out the duplicate, duplicate colors so that left me with 70 colored pencils and I also had the 50 set that I originally have so I'm, I'm pretty happy with the set that I have when I compare it to the colors that came in the 150 set there's like only 10 colors I don't have. I don't have the supportive colors for the Color of the World series. Hair color, eye color, I don't have those. And in the Color of the World, and in that 150 set comes with two new colors, but the two new colors are actually purples, and I think I already have a lot of purples. So yeah, if there's a small part of me that wants it to get those 10 colors I don't have. But there's another part of me is like, girl, you have enough. Now even your family is giving you art supplies. You need to stop. So let's get back to this one here. Uh, this was actually very nice. I actually enjoyed doing this. She's so happy to see her little um, fish friend. And it was beautiful. Under her is dark. And though I was thinking black, I wasn't thinking black because usually when we think dark we always think black but I was just thinking of a fiery redhead and that's the the intention that I went on and I really enjoy it with this color and I was able to use some grays and stuff like that so that was really nice I think we did this one too yeah and I actually enjoy having all the white stuff in her hair that was really beautiful. This is magic. And finally, Starry. Yeah. I think I might need to start adding some shadows here because 
they they look wonderful but i think i need to they need that they need some shadowing you know there's a little bit of shadows on them themselves but actually where she's sitting you know like here yeah i need to put some shadows in there especially on her she needs to somewhere here i think there's a, some shadows missing so i might have to fix this up but all in all let me bring you guys back out but all in all this is my mermaid higher <laughs> this is my mermaid for 2024 i didn't do a big prompt list and i'm still working through the honeymoon rate honeymoon nostalgia sketchbook uh I'm, I'm working through this guys i'm really working through this i'm about actually halfway the the the, the book now yeah see I'm actually halfway the book now that's really nice so I'm working my way through this book I have been throwing a lot of mediums at this book as you can see and let's see what happens for next month I'm not sure I'm looking at a few items that I want to explore for June I think I want to do the same thing for June that I did for May where I explore a medium and use that medium for it's that month's challenge I'm thinking of something like that will make it much more easier for me to do and I might also do that for the following months I'm not sure yet but you'll stick around stay tuned and you'll see what I've been getting up to thank you so much for joining me on this journey and as always stay safe stay blessed and I'll see you in the next one bye